Uh, I'm particularly amazed. You know, not much surprises me in life, but I'm absolutely shocked by the um, the anti-Semitism uh, we're seeing in London and the either defacing or tearing down of posters of hostage children and women. What does that say about this country that you can remove those, can uh, try and wipe out those memories, obliterate actual human emblems which are on these posters, but any criticism of anything else done by this mayor in this city is jumped on, and you know what we're talking about, like a hammer and a boot down on the neck of any dissenting views. It makes me feel very, very worried for England. And those that wave the flag in support of Hamas, which is a prescribed terrorist organization, whether the BBC can say so or not, um, I think should ev every single one of them should be deported and removed. In fact, I think Trump's travel ban in America was exactly the right thing. There should be a list of countries, especially countries that promote terrorism or uh, countries that harbor terrorists, uh, where there should be an absolute 100% travel ban to this country because we're gonna lose our country if we carry on like this. I can't see, I didn't, I didn't see any police. I saw one police go, uh, here, this is a sign saying, you know, from the river to the sea, Palestine must be free, which is calling for the eradication of Israel. Uh, and the police said, did anyone see this incident happen? But they still managed to find enough coppers to intimidate Sadiq Khan's political rivals. So I would say that these people need to be removed from the UK and it's an absolute tragedy. And it's, and it's a day marked in history for me that two Fridays ago, Jewish kids were too scared to go to school. And then the other thing that's come with this, actually, is I see that it is, is a, just a complete repurposing of the BLM movement. It's exactly the same players have just jumped up and now they're calling for the eradication of Israel and the Jews. No wonder the Jews are feeling terrified. Even some of our woker left wing Jews are saying um, they don't recognize London. And it has, we have seen an explosion uh, of anti-Semitism, so that should be utterly condemned. Uh, but in the same breath, it's just appalling what is happening to the people of Palestine who, who the cowardly terrorists of Hamas hide behind and use as human shields. And you can't send out your love and thoughts and prayers and hopes for the safe survival of Jewish children without applying exactly the same views to the innocence of Palestine.